very unique big five. I'm gonna start with nightlife. I got to go to dinner at the Baron to start out my night. It was delicious, there were premium meats, fabulous wines, and then I moved on to the cocoon, and I had so much fun. I had fun dancing, meeting people, and it really paralleled my experiences living in New York City. I never knew Johannesburg had such a depth in nightlife. Number four is hospitality. It's not a place, it's not a thing, it's just what South Africa is. South Africans have such big smiles and the service I've received here is top notch. And everywhere I've been, all the hotels, they're such premium, high class venues and it's been such a great experience being taken care of. Number three is fashion. I had the chance to go shopping in Johannesburg and everywhere I go, women are in top-notch clothing. It's becoming a fashion capital of the world and I'm so glad I got to visit and get a little slice of what it's like to wear South African clothes. Number two is wildlife. In just one night, I got to see four of the big five, including a leopard, which is really, really rare. Also, I'm very impressed with uh, South Africans awareness of wildlife conservation and how they're progressive in trying to protect animals and wildlife and secure the beautiful scenes that make up what South Africa is. Number one for me is Soweto. For me Soweto means family. My mom was born and raised here and my grandparents still live here so it means very much a value system that I always can come back to and I went to Hector Peterson Memorial. I also got to visit Nelson Mandela's house. I had such a great time learning of the history of Soweto and where I come from. I plan to bring so many people here to learn what it is truly like to be from here. I'm so proud to share what South Africa has. I'll be back, I love South Africa.